Okay, well, here we are. It is Friday the 13th of March, and we're just now finishing up this bridge, this new bridge for this cello that was damaged because of, uh, of a traffic accident. Uh, and so I just wanted to make a quick documentation of the fitting of the bridge. So what I've done is um, I've taken preliminary uh, steps to grind the base of the of the bridge so that it fits and conforms close enough to the valley so that we can begin the final adjustments. So in doing so, I uh, I have completed that portion. Now what I did was I put a piece of cellophane uh, plastic saran wrap on the belly of the of the instrument as you can see and we're setting the the uh, bridge up right at the the dimple of the F clef right is is about where the measurement is for the bridge to be seated accurately uh, in correspondence with the, um, the fingerboard. Now another very important thing is that the fingerboard is very unique on this cello so we've got the shape real real close to, to uh, identical to it. We took the dimensions and uh, as you can see, it's it's real close. So now what we're doing is we're fine-tuning and fitting the bridge to the belly of the cello. And what I have right here is 230 grit sandpaper. And I'll be working that sandpaper back and forth, filing it so that the fitting is accurate and so that there are no air gaps between the belly of the cello and the bridge. That's what we want so we have a real clean and and uh, and uh, the conveyance of the sound through the strings into the belly of the instrument will be real complete. So anyways we'll keep you posted. Uh, we're real close to finishing up on this project and we're hoping that this cello sounds just superb. We're hoping that um, the repairs were adequate. And um, we hope that, uh, that the sound is uh, as good as it's going to look. We'll be back. Goodbye.